What is up, YouTube Spectacular Spider Grandpa coming at you. Um, so yeah, this is a contest entry for uh, Semper Fi Comic Gift Guy, uh, Vince, uh, his 4th of July contest. And what he wanted uh, us to do is answer one of two questions, make a video answering one of, or both of these questions actually. Um, the first question being, what is the most um, patriotic comic book you've read or made you feel patriotic? And I've, I've been sitting here all morning trying to think of a book that actually made me feel that way. Um, and it's actually been pretty tough. Uh, other than the obvious, you know, Captain America. I mean, I love, I love this man to death, but I love his book. He's one of my top 10 favorite heroes but I'm gonna put him aside and kind of go down a different path um I hope this I don't I don't even care if I, this doesn't get me an entry into the contest um uh but I, I I think this segue would be nice so with that being said um you know a movie that really you know, made me want to run up and down the streets naked chanting USA, USA was actually Independence Day, which does have comic book tie-ins, so, um, yeah, so I hope, hope maybe this will qualify, Vince, what do you think? Anyway, you know, the whole speech where the president, um, tells ever the whole, uh, the whole resistance is standing outside the Air Force Base there, and he's telling everybody that this is this is our Independence Day. That that was awesome. This is actually one of my uh, top ten um, favorite sci-fi movies. Um, Independence Day, yeah. So this is my patriotic comic book slash movie that I love. Now, if you want to get um, military based. Um, one of my favorite military movies, military-based movies, is actually Saving Private Ryan. Um, again, another one of my favorite movies. If you want to see a big, uh, burly man cry, put this movie in, and I will cry at the end, or the beginning, and the end. I I call me a bitch if you will, but that just pulls on the heartstrings right there. That movie, so um, simplify. We also wanted to know um, some of our favorite Fourth of July memories. Wow. Um, so a few that stand out in my mind. Uh, you know, when I was growing up. Um, we couldn't get the good fireworks where I, where I lived and we always, um, went to my uncle's house and he would, he would get the, the good stuff, the M80s and whatnot. And we just, as kids, we just had a blast hanging out with my cousins and all that good stuff. I remember, um, my grandfather had a, a big metal tube and he would light an M80 and drop it in a tube and put a tennis ball in on top of it. So when the M80 went off, it shot that tennis ball up. And he used to give um, $20 to any kid, myself or any kid hanging out with us at my uncle's house. Uh, he used to give us that money if we caught that tennis ball. I don't think... Any of us ever did, but um, if you if you're able to get some M80s, try it yourself. We'll see how. Let me know how you do. Um, another um, one of uh, my favorite Fourth of July memories is actually uh, I served in the U.S. Navy from 1994 to no, I'm sorry, 95 to 99. I was stationed aboard the USS Enterprise. Every 4th of July, if we were underway, 
um, we would have what was called a steel beach picnic. And we would turn, they bring all the um, jets and helicopter down into the hangar bay. And the whole flight deck of the carrier would be um, uh, turned into um, volleyball courts, basketball courts. They had different departments, had games and barbecue and all kinds of stuff. I actually have a picture right here. This is actually um, my cruise book from, I forgot what year this is from. Um, shit. In any case, this picture right here is actually some of my shipmates grilling for the steel, one of the steel beach picnics we had. Um, they were so much fun. It was a good break from the monotony of everyday life on board a U.S. Naval vessel. So, Vince, um, Vince was in the Marines, a couple of my other buddies on YouTube were in the Marines, and so, I, I, I don't even know what to say anymore, but yeah, so, Semper Fi, this was my contest entry, um, I know it's not the best video, but, uh, oh, I was gonna show you my picture in, in this cruise book, let me find it real quick, give me two seconds here. Um, you guys won't even believe it's me. I was so skinny. So. God damn, I can't even find myself. Well, I guess with a carrier with 7,000 people on it. Here we go. Where my thumb is at, it's actually a uh, spider grandpa right there. So yeah, um, look at me, ain't I a sexy seaman? Yeah, for some reason I thought of comic noob when I said sexy seaman. No, no dirty jokes, comic noob. But anyway, that's it. Um, that's my contest entry. Uh. Um, thanks everyone for watching, hit like, subscribe, subscribe to Semper Fi Comic Guy, he's got a real cool contest, like I said, for the 4th of July, and I, I actually come watch both of us on Blaster to Stash at Friday night at 10pm Eastern, um, go check out, uh, Kirby's Comics and Huey's Comics, fellow panel members on, on Blaster to Stash it, and with all that being said, this is Spectacular Spider Grandpa saying be kind to one another.